Like, you can tell that I have drugs. Like, whoosh. I'm just like a pro at medicine. Like, anesthesia. We should go get drunk. How's it going? I'm Samantha. Welcome to another one of my amazing surgery vlogs. I had to have surgery a second time because they did not get the cancer out the first time. Just so you guys know, this isn't like, oh, they did a really bad job in removing the cancer. This is just because the cancer that was left over is like small and it looks like normal, regular breast tissue. So there's really no way for them to know if there's cancer without biopsying it after the surgery. But anyway, this time the surgery was not as big of a deal because they knew that they were just taking stuff out of the breast. They knew that they weren't going to be uh, doing stuff with my lymph nodes or anything because they already got all of that out. So they didn't use the actual general anesthesia on me. They just did like deep sedation or, or something. I don't know. It's it still makes you really loopy. It still completely knocks you out. It's the same anesthesia that was used when I had my IVF egg retrieval surgery. And if you saw in my other video about that, I got angry and yelled at the nurse and lots of people. <laughs> so if you want to see my reaction to it this time, then keep watching. I asked my boyfriend to film it for me because I like to look back on it and watch it and try to remember some of what happened and what I said. Here we go. <laughs> Farther south. I'm getting more surgery. Everyone's really excited this morning. It's 1039. <laughs> we're a little late. We're a little bit late. Not really, though. We'll probably get there at 11, which is when we're supposed to get there. They got it on the first try again. I got a sock. I got a bracelet. My arm hurts. I put my drain in this pocket that like I thought wasn't a real pocket, but they have like two pieces of fabric. You have to make sure it goes in the actual fabric or else it won't be in a pocket. It'll just slide through. So that's fun. I'm really hot. I'm having a hot flash. It's okay. You've got three layers of <laughs> warm <laughs> blankets. Too hot. <laughs> oh gosh. I can't move this hand to fan myself because it has the IV and I can't move this hand because this is where the surgery was so now she's fanning me with a bag. It's just no end what I will do for you. <laughs> it is now 2.11 and it hasn't started yet because they're behind schedule. Also it's freezing in here. So lots of blankets. Are you zooming in? I'm just fixing it. it was, the zoom was dumb. Oh. <laughs> they thought that Eric's cats were my cats. Because I was looking at Snapchats and there was one of Eric's cats. And they asked if they were mine, but they're not. I woke up and Dr. was on the phone. Oh, who was she talking to? I don't know. <laughs> I woke up when I was still in the operating room. And then they brought me over here. Because I got onto this bed. I was shivering before the surgery started. So they gave me really warm blankets, I guess. She didn't touch my feet. <laughs> She knew that she wasn't supposed to. Dr. kept touching my feet. <laughs> Why did she do that? Why the heck did she have to keep touching my feet? What the heck is her problem? I think there's a there's like a big memo going around the hospital about that. Don't touch I Samantha's said feet. You a Snapchat and I sent Cassie a Snapchat and I think I sent you guys different Snapchats. But I don't know because it says that they're sent like at the same time, like three minutes or wherever however long ago. And then I sent one to everybody. You sent me like 10. I sent you like 10. At least 5. No. Oh. 
I sent you five. <laughs> so. <laughs> what were they? <laughs> the first one was just a picture of your feet. <laughs> that was it. Yeah, and there's no text. And then the second one says, I don't remember what I sent you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that. And then I sent you one that said you were there coming to get you, right? He sent one that said, after surgery, and then I don't remember what the other one was. Oh, yeah, that's the one that I sent to everybody. I said, Samantha, after surgery. And then I tried to send one to Eric that said that they thought that his cats were mine. Oh, I did send that to him. He said my cats are not as friendly, lol. That's probably true. Actually, it is true. I got a Snapchat from Brooke. She says, I will not ask your pain on a scale of 1 to 10. Good job, Brooke. I keep asking on your pain scale. I don't know the answer. It's quite cold in there. I don't remember them giving me the oxygen this time. I just remember them giving me the verset, I guess. I was just looking around. They took my phone and put it somewhere. I don't remember them ever taking off my glasses. Yeah, and my throat was like is like super dry. So I asked them for water. No, it doesn't hurt. It's just like really dry. It just feels like there's something in there. I don't know, it's feeling really weird. I want to know what Dr. was saying on the phone. She well. was talking to someone and then I just got wheeled away. <laughs> Maybe you can ask her on your next appointment. <laughs> I'm not, I don't know if I'll remember this. It's well. really cold. That didn't take that long. It's no. only 4.05. Yep, she said it was really fast. And they took, they told me they took out my drain. Yep. No more drain. I think I woke up really fast. I guess you're supposed to? Mm-hmm. It's so cold in here. There's orange stuff. <laughs> Your the incision again? looks not as gross as before. You want to see? Don't show the camera. She said, um, you know, you couldn't take a shower again for two days. Please <sighs> don't let me take a shower. <laughs> other than that one. I don't think I've been mean to anyone yet. No, you've not been mean to anyone. Really? You're also not as sad. <laughs> yeah. Not. The drugs aren't as bad. Like, you can tell that I have drugs, like, whoosh, but like, <laughs> it wasn't like last time when I was like, uh. Do you, do you want another blanket? Do you have another blanket? Yeah, are these my original blankets they gave me? I don't know, would you like another one? It's not warm. <laughs> I think I'll see if I can get you another blanket. It's so cold. Also, I'm pretty sure they put ice in their water, but I don't believe in ice. What are you doing? That's a weird camera angle. What are you looking at? What are you looking at? Just you. Uh, Let's try and camera things. Is it your camera pro? You don't need to be like super close to me. like. My face isn't really that nice. I'll put that around your shoulders. <laughs> it's warm. Not that around your shoulders. Um, okay. I went onto the table and it was so cold in there. And then they were like, what do you need? And Dr. was like, she's shivering, so she needs some blankets. And I was like, yeah. <laughs> And then they gave me some blankets. And then I was like, thanks. 
<laughs> and then I looked around some more and I don't remember stuff. And then I woke up back where I was. What are you doing? I'm trying to see if that will get you warmer. And I like gave me the little thingy on my finger and they took it on my arm and she had to put the stuff on my ankles again but she didn't touch my feet <laughs> she said she wasn't gonna touch my feet this time <laughs> that was really nice do we get to leave soon probably i don't think they've asked my pain yet They've tell probably him. all been told not to. <laughs> tell them tell him to. I'm going to give you just a minute head start. Tell them to? <laughs> Why to? I don't know, it's a good number. Kind of the table blocks your face. <laughs> you gotta like, sit like this. You're not a very good videographer. <laughs> That's true. I'm way better than you at all camera things. Why don't you handle the camera? <laughs> I? would make so much more money than you. You already have. <laughs> <laughs> no, on your, on your photos. I'm a better photographer. No. <laughs> I'm really good. But I have a better camera. Yeah, but that's cheating. <laughs> what was the fist snapshot that I sent you? I don't remember. You're the one that's supposed to remember things. She told me that they give me a medical degree for, for the amount of time I spend with them. Or something dumb like that. They were like, man, it sucks that you've had to wait for so long. And I was like, yeah, I know, man. It's been a long time. They asked if I wanted crackers, and I told them two times that I didn't want crackers. <laughs> they made sure they really wanted to give me crackers. <laughs> they make me eat stupid crackers. I don't want crackers. This is so much better than the other real anesthesia. Yeah. It was really cold in there. I you were shivering. I was shivering. And they gave me warm, warm blankets. blankets. I said that already. <laughs> and then they're always like, what side are we doing it on? I'm like, your doofus is. <laughs> Can you not tell from the incision? I'm really glad they took the drains out, or the drain out. Because then I don't have to deal with it. Because people say that that's kind of weird when it comes out. That it's like, they just, they can feel it like pulling out. And that's just weird. I mean, you guys didn't have to wait that long, right? No. No. It was like less than an hour. Yeah. <laughs> that's good. Of course, had, you waited had, three hours before the surgery. I had the yeah, surgery. that took forever. But I did fix all of the pictures for you that were messed oh, up. Oh, good. There was just one. That well, there was saw. actually, there were two. Couldn't fix, the, couldn't fix the lamp. I couldn't enough. fix the lamp. I tried. Does oxygen just make she your throat dry? Thing. Why is my throat dry? Maybe something seriously wrong. You need to get it checked before you leave. No. Okay. It's not. Anyway, about the lampshade, it's missing the top Oof. thing. So what you can't top fix it. thing? You know how you screw it in to keep the lampshade tight? It's missing it, so the oh, lamp can't be fixed. Static electricity. I can go home and get bus. Yeah, <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't like bus. Yeah, they're good. Do we know anyone who does like bus now? Yeah. yeah. Jessica and Miss Hudson mm -hmm. and Cassie. <laughs> And, so and Eloise. Mm -hmm. I'm just like a pro at medicine. <laughs> like anesthesia. You're a pro. Alright, let's go. <laughs> <laughs>
we've been here too long. I don't feel nauseous. I can see your clothes. Have the smoothie app on your phone? Yeah. Should I order a smoothie? Well, once they say you can go, then it'll probably be a half hour before you can go. What did you guys do? Um, I fixed the pictures and I tried to fix the lamp and I got some coffee. And you what? Got coffee. What did you do? That's it. Walked over Greenberries and got coffee. What did you do? Ate a bag of chips. <laughs> what kind? Salt and vinegar. From where? Home. <laughs> Do you just have snacks in your backpack? <laughs> I did. <laughs> the operating right. room was a different operating room. Yes. I think. No, because you went a different way. Okay. Go left and the right. Mm -hmm. It's so cold. I was shivering in there. In the Should operating room. Get more bright blankets. They got me more oh. blankets. They won't be able to start processing it because it's a holiday weekend. That's so dumb. Well, like Columbus Day. It's Labor Day. Yeah, Columbus Day is in October. That's right. And my arm hurts and this hurts. Oh, we just need to find out. It barely hurts. Okay. Like, we can leave. Okay. How are you feeling? Good. Feeling okay? No. Excellent. You're next. Yay. I'm okay. gonna be next. You're next. Well, do you know when she comes in here and asks if things hurt? No, we can leave. <laughs> if you would just answer that they do, then maybe somebody can help. Did they give me medicine already? Yeah, but sometimes they can give you more, or they can give you different kinds. Mm. If you don't tell anyone anything, it doesn't they hurt that bad. <sighs> if I had a pillow, it'd be fine. Okay, would you like a pillow? I just want to go. It's really cold. <laughs> I want to put on my clothes. Why do you have to be annoying? They are really good because they like come get you earlier than they did at the other place. Yeah, they said they were going to. Is that better? Yeah. Like I didn't even make ask them to come get you. So you didn't want to see us as badly as you did last year. No, but they just did it. <laughs> last time they were like, no, they can't come yet. And I was like, you're dumb. <laughs> it's freaking frigid. That's on Rachel's cold, cold <laughs> scale. That's right. So you could go to the beach. She did. You can't get wet, but. You can go. You I can't can, get wet? You can go up to your, you can't get the incision in the ocean. She said you can go, you can go up to your waist. Remember when that pitcher died unexpectedly? Back in no. May? Major League pitcher. He had oxycodone and uh, alcohol in the system. And alcohol blamed on. Oh, you haven't had that. We should go get drunk. No, we right. plan. They get off the drugs. Oh my gosh, it's so cold. It was cold in the operating room. Yeah, I know. I already told you. <laughs> the part, <yeah. laughs> She's definitely ready to go now. It was so cold in there, though. I bet you were shivering. <laughs> well, nothing's happening. <laughs> really want to leave. You're next. Oh, my throat hurts. So yeah, that's basically all the footage I have. After that, I got dressed and I left and we got a smoothie and then I went back home and went to sleep. So you didn't really miss anything. At that point, I was kind of aware of what I was saying, what I was doing. 
So uh, I didn't really say anything else very interesting. Sorry to end it sort of abruptly, but I just wanted to go to sleep. <laughs> But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and check out some of the other videos that I've done. Subscribe to support me on my cancer adventures and follow me on Instagram to get more updates. Yeah, that's all. Bye.